Rachel Ducker, magazine editor, influencer, and most importantly, mummy to two-year-old Leo and to this little one who's due in September. The Baby Show Live have kindly asked me here today to give my experience as a mum having gone through the newborn process and just about to do it again. So I'm going to show you my favourite brands, there's quite a few so I hope you've got your pen and paper ready, but it should include everything you'll need to set up for your new little arrival. The first thing you'll need for a baby right from the word go is nappies and wipes. As my mum journey has continued, I'm trying to use eco-friendly products. So this range from Kitten Kin is perfect. Their wipes are biodegradable and plastic free and the nappies are free from all the nasties. So you know with both these products, your baby is going to be very, very safe. These premium hypoallergenic nappies also have the cutest animal designs on. I'm just gonna get one to show you. This one is an owl and I'm sure you'll agree your little ones will look just adorable in them. You'll also need a nappy bin. I like the Corbell nappy bin. It's eco-friendly with biodegradable bags. Now, when it comes to strollers, there are so many on the market. So today I've picked one that will completely future-proof you. The eye candy orange is amazing and I will tell you for why. With its ingenious integrated ride on board, lightweight chassis, spacious basket and ability to upgrade to a double or twin push chair, the orange can cater for any parent's needs. Its spacious, fleece-lined carry cot is suitable for overnight sleeping too. So it's a perfect Moses basket or travel cot solution. It's suitable from birth. And as you can see, for me, with a two-year-old son already, I can have Leo at the front and baby at the back, nice and close. It comes with a separate seat. So when baby outgrows the basket, you can have a double push chair. It was really easy to put together and it's the perfect solution for me at the moment with my growing family. Next on to baby carriers. Sometimes there's just places you can't take your baby in a stroller and it's easier to have them close to you, especially when they're so young. I have a couple of favorites. The first is from Nuna. Now I love this brand. This one comes in four different settings so you can have four different positions. It means that it grows with your baby as they get bigger. The next is the Dream Genie Snuggle Roo Baby Carrier. It slips on really easily and has been designed to create movements of the womb. Ideal for newborns. Or for something super stylish, this new Baby Bjorn Harmony Carrier goes up until the age of three years old. When you want to take the baby home from the hospital, you're going to need a car seat. So the Cybex one is the one that I would recommend. And here's for why. To make it easier to get your child out of the car, the seat can be swiveled, which is just ideal, thanks to its rotating base. It's also equipped with linear side impact protection, which significantly increases your child's safety in a side impact collision. Cybex Cloud Z Eye Size. Next up, Moses baskets. Now, I think these are brilliant little inventions. Basically, when I had Leo, I was moving around the house quite frequently in the daytime. So if I had a little bit of work to do on the computer, I could simply carry this as it's so lightweight and pop him right next to me while I was working. It's easily transportable, so if you're going away, then you can simply pop it in the car. The stand also is easy to fold and just a lovely little set. If you prefer to have a cot in your bedroom for your baby, the Stocker Mini Sleep is ideal. It's so lightweight and compact and you can move it from place to place. Here's a little video on how it works. It's the perfect first bed for your baby and its distinctive oval shape provides you with a sense of security, creating a cozy nest-like environment. It has adjustable height positions and like many other stocker products in the range, the Sleepy expands to accommodate changing needs and sizes as your child grows. It's essential to have a wide selection of blankets. This one from Hippie Chick is wonderful. It's cable knit and 100% cotton. There's a range of different colors and Hippie Chick also have a load of baby products on their website. Really good if you're just looking for a variety of different baby products. Another blanket perfect for travel is the Cura Organic Baby Wrap. 
Its universal design means it can be used with pretty much any stroller or car seat. Every parent loves peace of mind when their baby's sleeping, so the Owlet Duro is essential. It comes with the Owlet Sock, which monitors the baby's heartbeat, as well as the Owlet Monitor, which just keeps an eye on your baby and you can actually check in on your phone. The Duo set covers every angle, giving you that peace of mind and reassurance. When I used to night feed Leo, I always used to use my iPhone as a light. I couldn't actually see, but I didn't really want to wake him up. So now I found out about the new Schnuggle Moonlight. This is ideal because it is a night light so that if you're breastfeeding or moving around at night, you can pick it up off its temperature sensing dock and use it however you wish. There's also a child mode so that as your child gets bigger, it can also be used by them and carried around as a night light. It's a lovely little product, so make sure you check this one out. The next product you will formally know as Sleepyhead of Sweden, but now under the name Dokotot, this product is really, really useful to have around the home. For me, when I wanted to go out in the garden or take a bath, I'd simply use it as a dock to put Leo in, make sure that he's safe while I get to have some me time. Just to note, it is advised that you don't let your baby sleep in these and that whilst your baby is in the product that they are assisted. It's a product that I will definitely be using with my next baby and the covers are changeable so it's really easy to wash if you have those little accidents. If you prefer not to use blankets, then sleep sacks like this from Halo are the perfect substitute. They are the experts in baby safe sleep and this one comes in a couple of colours, so check out the range from Halo. I also love these Ergo Pouch Swaddle Bags. They are designed to be both easy to use, but difficult to escape from. Available from stylemykid.com. Next, on to one of my lifesavers. Now, you're either a mum who agrees with dummies, pacifiers, whatever you want to call them, or you're someone who prefers not to, and either way is absolutely fine. But for me, as my son was very young and a little bit restless at times, these were my saving grace. Now, Curaprox Baby are amazing. They do these soothers, which actually helps the mouth development. They're not too big and they're easy breathable. So they come in a range of colors. And for me, these are my preferred dummies. During those really early months, I cannot tell you how many muzzies you will get through in just a day alone. So these ones from Aiden and Anne are just gorgeous. I found them really lightweight, easy to use and easy to wash. Aiden and Anne also do these other lovely kits, which include clothing and little comforters. So you can get the whole collection in one go. Another brand I particularly love for muslins is Etta Loves, and they do this wonderful range of sensory muslins. When your baby's young, it's really important to keep them stimulated and calm. So these are perfect. They also do this wonderful play mat. So if you want somewhere comfy and soft just to keep your baby, this is perfect. Fabalab also do some great swaddles available from starmykid.com, plus they come in a range of colors. Now onto breast pumps, and for me, the game changer was the LV pump. Now, I cannot recommend this more. For me, I was still working when I had Leo, so if I had to leave him with my husband or my mum, I could leave um, an express bottle of milk. This is the LV pump. It's so discreet, you simply pop it down your bra, and you can control it with an app on your phone, once you've got a full bottle of milk, then you simply remove it and put it into a bottle. It's so discreet that once I went for lunch with my husband, expressed while I had lunch, and I was able to give Leo lunch afterwards. For me, I always found breastfeeding a little bit daunting in public, something I preferred to do out of the public eye. So this little device just made my life so much easier. Something new that I didn't have with Leo is the LV Catch. So this is simply a silicone cup that you just pop in your other bra whilst you're pumping and it catches the excess. After all, a little bit of extra milk goes a long way. During my last birth, unfortunately, I had to have an emergency C-section. My baby was almost 10 pounds free, which was pretty big. So 
a really, really useful product for me was a breastfeeding pillow. This one is from BB Hug Me and I'm just gonna show you. Like its pregnancy pillow, it comes in a range of colors, really comfortable for baby. Place baby here and you've got a nice comfy area for your baby to lie on, making feeding so much easier. When it comes to bottles, even though I breastfed, I still use bottles quite regularly. So the brand that I particularly enjoyed the last time I had Leo was Nano Baby. Now these bottles are new, they've been out since May, and they are called the Flexi Silicone Bottle. But not just for breastfeeding mums, they are also perfect for formula fed babies as well. Nano Baby also do some other really useful products, so if you're breastfeeding, this is particularly helpful. It's actually a little breast milk storage container, so you can actually put breast milk bags into this container, pop them in the fridge, and keep them organized. Lastly, the newborn starter kit is ideal. You get everything you need, including the boob shape bottles, which I also really like. They're a great bottle to introduce to baby if you've never had a bottle before. The sterilizing unit also keeps the bottles nice and sterilized and safe. Plus there's also a little drainer and a few other accessories in the box. So definitely check this out because you don't have to go anywhere else. It's got everything you need right here. Another one of my favorite brands is Milton. You know that with Milton in your handbag or in your cupboard, you're gonna keep your baby safe from germs. They do a range of things from travel sterilizers to wipes to sterilizing tablets. With all of these products at your disposal, your house will be germ-free and safe for baby. Now, when it comes to clothes, I don't know about you, but I go a little bit crazy. So I have a few particular brands that I really, really love to dress my babies in. The first is Mamas and Papas. Now, as you can see, they have an amazing range here of the most adorable baby outfits. Now, when your newborn is a newborn, you might wanna go for a smaller size. However, I did this last time and like I mentioned earlier, ended up with a massive baby. So I would get a few really simple, small newborn pieces like these. <laughs> Very cute, isn't it? And I would also then go for a naught to three months to make sure you've got a varied selection. And you know that if you get naught to three months, your baby's gonna grow into it eventually anyway. As well as some cute outfits, these packs are also really handy to have. They usually have two to three in a pack and it's just basically a little sleep suit so you can make sure that you've got plenty. And for new mums, a little bit of advice, you might go for a few of these. So do make sure you have plenty on hand. The other thing that I also didn't know is that you need to keep the baby's head warm, especially in those first few weeks. So Rachel Riley do a lovely selection of not only clothes, but beautiful cashmere hats like this, and the most adorable cashmere boots. Now again, I do have a few favorite brands. Mori is one of them. Japanese inspired, this newborn baby kit not only arrives in the most beautiful packaging, but you will find the products are so soft. So the newborn baby starter set is great. It comes with a couple of outfits, a muslin, and also a little sleeping bag. Now the next product is a recent discovery for me and I'm so excited about using it. I haven't used it yet, but I'm told that this is another star product for mums. It's called the Rocket. Now you simply put this on the edge of your stroller and it rocks the baby to sleep. So if you're out for a coffee with your friends, this does all the work for you, keeping your baby nice and calm. Now on to bath time, and for me, there's only one bath. The Snuggle Multi Award winning bath is ideal for newborn babies. It has a special bum bump in the bottom, which stops them from going anywhere. And also it has a foam backrest, so you know it's gonna be nice and comfortable for your baby. There's a plug in here, which is perfect for draining, and it holds up to two liters. Also, if you do have a second child like me, and for bonding time, there's another solution. Snuggle also do a toddler bath, which is exactly the same, minus the bum bump. 
and as you can see here it will make bath time so much easier with a growing family as you can sit the babies in the bath together it's great for sibling fun time another product perfect for after bath time is a product that i wish that i knew about with leo it's the cuddle dry and it simply allows you to cuddle your baby dry so what could be better than that it's bamboo and cotton fabric it's super soft it's perfect for growing as the baby grows and it's also really good for swimming so you can double it up as a bath and swimming towel this product was also seen on dragon's den and it's something that i'm definitely going to be using with my new baby every little one needs their own comforter and i love these bb's this one is a donkey, which I have got for the new baby. You can record your voice, which is really soothing for your little one. It also comes on automatically if they cry at night. It also plays white noise and lullabies. Pretty cute. Mooney Rabbit is also a great choice, available from starmykid.com. Even the big ones love them. Now, in terms of a baby gym, this one is from Love Every. It's a really nice place to leave your baby. There's lots of activities you can put on there. It's got sensory. So it's the perfect little play mat for development. Just like the Moses basket, another transportable baby device is a bouncer. Now I love this baby Bjorn bouncer. It's got lovely fleecy fabric, which is easily washable. You can simply pop it off and put it into the washing machine. And all you have to do is gently Give it a little bounce now as your baby does get a little bit bigger he or she will be able to bounce themselves and they will absolutely love it although it might be a little bit young for your newborn to start feeding there's no reason why he or she can't join the family at the dining table it's great for interaction my personal preference of high chair is the stocker trip trap now the reason for why is that it actually grows with your baby so it should see him or her through until beyond being a child. In fact, my husband still has his. So the trip trap comes in a range of colors and it has a newborn set. The newborn set simply is removable and you can turn it into a high chair as soon as baby has outgrown it. The stocker range is definitely built to last. Now, as for nappy bags, there's one brand that I could not do without. They do such a range of beautiful bags and you can personalize them. They are from Kerikit. Now they come in sizes of backpacks to handbags and there's just so much space in them. They come with a nappy changing bag and little zip pockets. So pop over to Kerikit and check out their full range. In the year of the staycation, you may wish to take a little mini break. If you require a travel cot and you want to take your own, the Baby Bjorn one is ideal. It's so light and really easy to put up. Now, how easy was that? Like me, I don't know about you, but I absolutely love to keep record of my baby's milestones. So this baby's first year baby book from Lucy Darling is just so cute. It's really simple and easy to fill in. And likewise, these milestone pennants are great so that you can document your baby's growth and that's it. So thank you so much for joining me today. There's so much to cover, so I hope that it's been really beneficial to you all. I will be available for any live Q and A's if you have any questions about any of the products and any of the brands. I'm wishing you the best of luck in your baby adventure, whether you're a new mum or you're growing a family like me. I'm Rachel Ducker and you can follow my account on Instagram at Rachel Ducker. Please get in touch with me as I love to support and follow other mums. We're all in this together.